I'm Chef Amber, and I'm so excited and passionate about showing you that what you put in your body matters right now today. Now, if you've been following me on YouTube or Chef Amber LA, then you already know that I'm completely obsessed with smoothie bowls. I love them. I almost get a pound of veggies in for breakfast. Frozen zucchini, broccoli, purple sweet potato, cauliflower, and I use the veggies frozen like ice cubes, and I do less fruit in my smoothie bowls to have it be a little bit low glycemic. I'm not opposed to fruit, I'm just showing different options. Another thing I like about smoothie bowls is the fact that you're gonna see after we make this today, you're not gonna be able to taste the cauliflower and the zucchini. Let's get started. So I wanna just do a little chat about all the veggies. So right here I've got steamed frozen cauliflower. Great thing about this too is you don't have to add ice. Like I know going to other restaurants and stuff, a lot of people use like a ton of ice in their smoothies and their smoothie bowls. This way we're getting all of our, our veggies and our nutrients. Okay, for zucchini, zucchini and squash, I leave the skin on, I chop them up in small pieces, little diced little pieces like this, raw, I do not steam those. I put them in a little baggie and everything goes in the freezer. Everything I portion individually and I do reuse my baggies, okay? So I've got about one cup of frozen zucchini here. You can also sub yellow squash right here, that's perfect. I'm using a half a cup of wild organic blueberries loaded with antioxidants, helps with some heavy metals, and the main ingredient is blue magic. So I wanna show you first of all how gorgeous this is. Like, beautiful, right? So blue magic is an algae. What I love about it, it's got a little bit of a smell, but it's nothing compared to all the other algaes like spirulina and chlorella. The beautiful thing about this is it's gonna make this bright blue. So already, when I serve this to people, it's beautiful to eat. They're so excited to dive into it. They don't even ask chef what's in it. When they've scraped the bowl, then, I, then they say, oh my God, that was so good. What was in it? And I was like, oh my God, well, I had cauliflower and zucchini. That was the base, okay? Beautiful thing about Blue Magic is it doesn't really have a flavor at all. And E3 claims, E3 Live is the company, they claim that it's great for helping repair uh, muscle tissue, it's great for gut, it's good for um, ligaments, it's really good for recovery. Um, I use it um, when I'm doing a lot of weight training or when I used to run, okay? So a lot of athletes use um, Blue Magic. And then I'm gonna put maca in here because maca really helps me recover from outside stressors. So maca is a root. It's actually great for stamina. It's great for libido. Um, I take it almost every day. And maca is really, it's got a really yummy malty flavor and smell. But what I love about it is that it, it's actually an adaptogen. And I always speak about adaptogens. And they just help our body basically recover and adapt to those outside stressors that are thrown our way, right? All these stressors in the environment, it really helps soothe and calm our nervous system. All right, I'm gonna put a big old tablespoon. And cinnamon, I always use cinnamon, so I'm just gonna do a little sprinkle of cinnamon in here, about a half a teaspoon. Great for inflammation, circulation. And then our protein today is, I'm using a pea protein. It's by New Zest, three ingredients. I'm not a sponsor, I just found that this protein is the cleanest, it actually does not bloat me out, and I don't get um, indigestion with it. And the milk today we're gonna use, I'm gonna use a cinnamon pumpkin seed milk. I'm gonna just start off. So with smoothie bowls, it's smart to start off with a little bit of liquid. I'm gonna give you the measurement, but you can't take it back if you do too much, you can always add to it. So I'm gonna do a little bit there. Thing about a smoothie bowl is you've gotta have some sort of tamper. I'm using a Vitamix. You can use any other blender. I have never owned another blender. I'm like the Vitamix queen, my restaurant uses it. So you have to have a tamper because this is where the work comes. Okay, whoo. So these are a labor of love. Took about two minutes. I'm like kind of sweating right now, but let's see the reveal because this is like my favorite. Oh yeah, this is the best part. Can you see how blue that is? It's amazing. Okay, let's get that in here. And this is loaded with protein, tons of fiber. I mean, let's talk about fiber for a minute. We're so deficient, most of us are deficient in fiber. So think if you could start your breakfast out with, oh my God, I've had almost close to a pound of veggies already in my, in my day. Okay, loaded with protein, antioxidants, 
yummy maca for hormone. Look at how gorgeous this is, right? So when you serve this, just wait for the reaction. People are like, what is that? I'm so excited to eat it. Okay, so I'm gonna add some cacao nibs. So a couple of my favorite toppings is I want some extra antioxidants and energy from the cacao. So I'm gonna just do a couple of the cacao nibs on there. I also like to put bee pollen, and I know these might be unique ingredients, so I'm just, I'm just having fun right now and showing you some options, but I love bee pollen, and it just helps with immunity, and it's also really beautiful on the blue. <laughs> okay, and then because we're in August right now, there's a lot of stone fruit. If you're watching this at any time of the year, go crazy here, add whatever favorite fruit you want or don't add fruit. I'm gonna actually add some yellow nectarines and these gorgeous little golden um, apricots I found. So I'm gonna do that. Sometimes I top it with pumpkin seeds, granola, a big scoop of almond butter. If you wanna do a drizzle, if this isn't sweet enough, you could do a drizzle of honey or maple. I find that it's sweet enough with the protein powder and the blueberries, but you might want it a little sweeter. So here we are, our recovery smoothie bowl. Gorgeous, right? I can't wait to see how you like it. Please share with me. Tag me if you make it so I can see your gorgeous photos. If you haven't already subscribed, subscribe below and continue to be on this journey with me. And if you're not following me on social media, I'm Chef Amber LA. And if you want any other sexy, beautiful recipes and any tips for holistic living, you can head on over to chefamber.com. All right, well, I'm super excited. I've got to get in here right now. Until next time, have a great day. Ciao, ciao.